dawn of the first day. Good morning, good morning. How do, how do you do? Hello, good day. <laughs> Don't ask me how I remember that song from when I was little. I just do. Well, hello, little dick. Who's ready to go for a polar bear swim? You are. Look how good you swim. Look at you. Or is his name Tiny Dick? Is it Little Dick or Tiny Dick? I don't remember what I initially called him, but meh, it's one and the same. Who cares? Speaking of polar bear swims and being extremely cold in the morning and freezing your balls off, we are gonna head to the mountains today. And Link's gonna freeze his balls off because he doesn't have any tights on or anything. Yes, I do have a sword and you can let me through, but what I should really have on is like long sleeves and a parka and I don't know, snow boots? Something like that. Come on, man. You don't want me to catch a cold, do you? <laughs> he's like, whatever. As long as he has a sword, he's good. Okay, I'm gonna get a few supplies here because I definitely have to have arrows. I think I just picked some up. And money, 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 money. Money's always good to have too because we gotta buy a map, I believe. All right, oh shit. It's a Dodongo. I can't wait to bump some Dodongos. Just kidding, not in this game. They are bitches in this game. I suck at fighting Dodongos. Not even exaggerating right there, so. We'll just save that embarrassment for later. All right, what we gotta do is cut down the giant penis icicle, which is what it looks like. An uncircumcised penis icicle. Not that I would know, because I've never seen an uncircumcised penis. At least not in real life. Wait, what? <laughs> Let's just pretend I never talked about this. Shit never happened. Let's ice skate, Link. Woo! This is why he needs some snow boots or something, because the traction here is shitty. You die, spider. What do you think you're doing here? It's too cold for insects. What the hell? Money, 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 money. Thank you very much. They sound itchy. They're like itchy spiders. Something's wrong with them. They're spiders with the crabs. Crabby spiders. No wonder they're so angry. Come here, little spider. I'll scratch you with my sword. Yeah, all better. No more itchiness. <laughs> if you ever need a good scratching, just call Link. Oh, bombs. Yeah, you're definitely gonna need at least the smallest bomb bag here or the blast mask. And yes, I do know that I can use the shield and to protect myself from the explosion. Boom! Pretty much every other comment in my last video was, Donna, put up your shield when you use the blast mask. You won't get hurt. Like, seriously, people, you can't read past comments. Ugh. I love you guys, though. Thanks for helping. Even though 15 billion people before you said the same thing. <laughs> get away from me, spider. I know you're trying to give me your crabs. Boom, buggy bitch! <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, well, actually, I get that they're not really spiders. They're like the bugs in the bottle that you catch, because they only have four legs, so... What are they called? Technically? Tektites! Haha! -ha! I remembered. Ooh, this place sure does feel lonely. Especially with this music. And the voices, just... Oh. I always thought it was really creepy. Creepy, lonely music. But then there's this guy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, up here, up here. I'm sorry to bother you for such a high place, but I'm very hungry and I've gotten stuck here. Really, dude, you're on a ledge. You can just, like, fall off. I would feel sorry for him, but his logic is not there. He's not stuck. I can imagine if he were in a hole, but no. He doesn't have to climb out of anywhere or use any energy for anything. He literally has to roll his fat ass off the edge. The end. <laughs> Mountain Smitty ahead. We sharpen any sword. We work hard, so your sword works hard for you. Awesome. I'm definitely gonna come back to this place later because I wanna get my sword pimped out by these guys. They do some good work there at the Mountain Smitty. <laughs> but as I said, we're gonna have to wait until later after I actually beat the temple, so patience, patience. What the hell, Link? Just grab the magic! Gah! I didn't even need it. You're just circling around. Link, I have no time for you and your silly shenanigans. I need 
some money because there's Tingle up there and I need enough rupees to actually buy a map. Are there any in this snowball? Nope. Well, too bad for you, Tech Tite. You're gonna have to die for my map. Die! Yes! Money, 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 money. I didn't actually think he'd have rupees. That was awesome. So Link, you basically committed murder and then stole the victim's wallet. Link, you're a monster. Oh well, it was for the greater good because I need a freaking map. All right, Tingle, get your overgrown child man ass down here. Thank you very much. Map, sir. I need it. Yes. <laughs> that reminds me, I still need to get a picture of him for the guy in the swamp. People have been telling me that I already did that and got the heart piece, but I'm pretty damn sure I didn't. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky. Aww. Okay, I gotta admit that little dance was pretty cute. And even though Tingle is a 35-year-old man-child, <laughs> and is kind of creepy in that sense, at least he's a really memorable character, so he's got that going for him. I think it's much better to be remembered and have people have really strong opinions on you, good or bad, than to just be totally forgotten. So you just keep being you, Tingle. Being unique and crazy and weird and... I don't know, it's not really good that your family disowned you, but... They'll see, maybe, one day. <laughs> Hopefully. Dude, this guy looks cold. He looks worse than Link. Put on some clothes, man! It's cold! Being the gatekeeper in this cold is... <laughs> hard! <laughs> yes, I do want to go to the Goron Shrine. Thank you very much. Then I'll open the door. Alright, we gotta get in fast, because it closes right behind you. I wonder if you can stand under the door and wait for it to close on you. <laughs> That's terrible. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Hopefully Link doesn't just walk right in. Oh, he did! He just walked right in! Boo! <sighs> what is this I hear? Oh god, it's the scariest thing in the entire game! A baby! Quick, somebody eat it! Why me? Oh, the horror! Quick, mute the game! <laughs> oh, that cutscene with like the swirling. Oh, it just captures the insanity that these Gorons must be feeling. I'm so sorry, bro. Are you okay? Speak to me! This is the room of the Goron Tribe's Elder. Unfortunately, he's out. Since the Elder's gone, his son won't stop crying! No shit! Shut it the fuck up! Dude. Kill it with fire! Or if we don't have fire, then... Pottery! If I can get in front of it. Boom! That didn't work. Plan B. Beat it with a stick. You die! No! My sticks are no match for the infant. Daddy! Daddy! I'm cool! Daddy! Oh my god. Kid, I'll be your daddy. I don't care. As long as you shut your big mouth. Oh my god. The Goron's dancing around in the corner. He's going insane. I feel so bad for these poor Goron souls. Link, we have to save them. Seriously, though. Something has to be done about that kid. But if I don't get out of here, then the next two seconds, I think my brain is about to explode. One... Two. Oh, thank God. Oh. Beautiful silence. Apparently, Donna should never become a parent. Just saying. Oh. And who might you be? 